and safety has always been a consideration in the kitchen. Sharp objects, hot objects, heavy objects that occur every single day. You're dealing with hot pans, hot stoves, hot oil, open burners, knives and things like that, so you're always aware of it. Safety has always been a main consideration. It's one of our top priorities. I'm far more concerned now about safety than I ever have been before. So people need to learn to like maybe take a breath and slow down and think about what they're doing before they rush into it. Over the past 20 years, safety has been more of a, a learning experience for me. When you're first getting into the business, I don't think that you feel that you can think about the safety aspect. You're just trying to do as best as you can to impress your employers. And maybe a lot of people that are just starting out are a little too shy. It takes time to learn this craft. Don't rush into things. People will show you the proper technique and a proper way to use pieces of equipment. Take care of you first. The restaurant or, or the food truck or whatever, they're going to survive. It's going to be okay. I think the most important thing is developing your own personal culture of safety. Your own personal safety starts with you. From a young person's point of view or a young employee's point of view, if your employer won't listen to you, they're not worth working for. In a small restaurant, when you only have six cooks, if somebody's down for a couple of weeks or a month with an injury, you've lost 20% of your workforce. So everybody else has to work harder, work more shifts, lose their weekends, all those types of things. The success that I have in my career is due in a part in the fact that I work safe. That was instilled to me as a young cook. Nobody just was born a top-notch chef. Everybody started out as a dishwasher. These people that are above you, they were you in the beginning, you know? And they had questions, and they were unsure, and they were uncertain, and so you have to remember that. Just get the line of communication going. Speak up. If we're missing something or overlooking something, I rely on my cooks and the people I'm working with to ensure that we're all working in a safe environment. Your health is your most valuable asset that you have. You have to make sure that you take care of it and you want to have a long career.